All right, I'm tearing up the script here to a degree because we want to keep this conversation going and talk about stop and frisk. You know, for me, some of this is, there's a debate to it, but there's also facts. And, and certainly what came out of the district court in New York um, was pretty clear in the judge's ruling. They looked at the numbers and the preponderance of evidence that this was a directive from above here um, to do this. And not just the policy of stop and frisk, but to get these quotas. So from my end, again, I just got this overarching question. I may not like it, but if this thing was working and that half the people they stopped, they were pulling guns off them, I might say, sucks to be them. But and uh, I would agree with you. But 90% of these guys got nothing wrong, David. And I just, well, what I, I don't uh, understand is this. We said this in the beginning. Why in God's name would a young black guy in a neighborhood cooperate with the cops when there's an investigation if they've been hassled five times this kid on his 18th birthday had guns drawn on him because he was walking from his grandmother's okay. house. I, I, I understand that. And I agree that there shouldn't be any misuse of any policy, no matter what. But this is but not isn't a, this, a policy designed this, 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 and leading to misuse. Well, how how you, can it possibly any, any, not any be anything Any but? policy can be misused by somebody who wants but to misuse it. it. Most police, to be. most police officers by a overwhelming, to use your term, preponderance of the evidence, use this policy responsibly. And again, to everyone watching, if you're concerned, you have the right to say no. Okay. That is in the Time law. Out. You're a young man, you're 18. Literally, this kid that we just showed here about 10 minutes ago, he's walking out of his house with five guys. Cops get out of squad cars, plural, guns drawn, and told to get down in the dirt. Are you going to say, no, actually, I'm going to refuse my stop they, and they frisk? Did, they, they didn't do that without some other evidence they said they attached look like to other it. Guys. All right. And if they're looking and they for were somebody, let them go and, if, and if they're looking for somebody, well, let me let me give you a simple example. If people are concerned about profiling and looking for criminals, if you're looking for two black men of a certain thing or two Hispanic men or two of any in a white van, do you put out a, a bolo, a be on the alert lookout for that particular scenario? The, what the, what I'm let sorry, me the, the problem with your analogy is that they're not looking for somebody of a certain description. They're not looking for two black men in a white van. They're just looking for black men that they're pulling over no, uh, uh, as they're walking down the street. Excuse and, me. And, black, no, no. black men with, with, with a hood on or black men with Puma sneakers okay, or DJs. Okay, so I, let me ask I you a question. I appreciate what the if difference? they're looking for white men? I, I, and that's a good point that I raised yesterday. What if they're, what if they're looking for white men? That's a good point that I raised yesterday. They're not looking have you ever anybody. seen, and, and I'm I'm not trying to make this black or white, but have you ever seen a white person up on a wall being frisked by yes, police? I I've have. never seen it in my life. Have you seen Does it? Does that mean it doesn't happen? Have see, you seen see, it? Here, here's here's the problem example, here. No. We're trying to make this simple. You just say you don't want it to be a black white but problem. But it is a black and white but problem. The, when you have the majority of the crimes being committed in an area and it happens to be black, that's where you're going to have the They're majority of the activity. For anybody in particular. They're looking for people that they label as suspicious, and the result of this is overwhelmingly black it, and Hispanic. It's, 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 the reason why I get so We're not going to solve this, but I think this is a good discussion. I just, I guess my only point, David, is rap is. We all know this, uh, the stain on American history, obviously slavery and racism and everything else. Does that mean everything today is that same no, stain? No, it doesn't, but we do know it's part of the equation where if you just say, if you, if you got the wrong color, we're going to put the concentration in particular. They're not going to Park Ave to do this, right? Look, and look I, Richard, I agree with you. Let me give you a final point on this then and sum it up. To the black kids out there and the ones that are committing the crimes and the community leaders that are more concerned about black on black crime, the murders in Chicago by blacks on blacks or Hispanic or black on Hispanic, the second largest group. Here's an idea. Work on getting that problem out of America. Then you reduce the need for the police so to the, go into so the in communities. The meantime, but, but, but so the, go, but, to the, go to the I, root of the real you know problem. What? I agree with you. But... It should not be in this great country where it's a rite of passage for every black and Latino man it's that at not, some point before you're is. 18, you're going to be thrown up on the wall and, 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 and that's going to be the last word on this. We're going to jump to a break.